wanna know me, I stay low key, all gas, no brakes, baby, let them hoes sleep. Body on ten, make your girl OD. I get in my way, never out of my lane. So, mom and dad, I know y'all are um just getting off of work and everything, but I just found out something that y'all won't be proud of me about. But I hope that y'all will still support me and have my back anyway. But, um, yeah. Raya, what are you really talking about? Like, you have us sitting on this couch saying you got some big announcement, some big thing going on. Like, what happened? Exactly. I've been at the office all day, and I really just want to lay down and go to sleep. So, what is this news that you got for us? Like, spit it out already. Well, today I wasn't feeling well. My stomach was acting up a little bit. And I went to the nurse at school, and I guess part of her policy is she has to give you a pregnancy test when you complain about stomach problems. And, um, my test came back positive and I'm so sorry mom and dad I'm so sorry I promise I did everything right I followed everything y'all told me I don't know how this happened I don't know don't know how this happened you know exactly how this happened but you know what since you can't respect our teachings enough to do the right thing maybe you can respect it when you're out there doing it on your own I want you out of this house now but Ma, where am I gonna go, Ma? I, I don't can't wanna do this hear it, Ryan. You can't you do know this better. You can't. We taught you about this. I didn't mean this. to do it. I we promise. told you I to be safe. We told you to talk to us before you did anything. It was and an accident, you deliberately Mom, did not. Don't. Don't I want you out of this house don't. now. What am I supposed to do now? What am I supposed to do? I have no idea where am I gonna go. How am I gonna get money? How am I gonna fend for myself? I have no idea what to do. Raya and I would like to check myself in to the shelter. What is going on everybody? It's your girl J Love coming at you with another video and my lovies we are here in San Sequoia with our girl well her name is being changed to Raya with our girl Raya for our runaway teen pregnancy LP. Now First things first is let me let me change this because baby it's a lot right now Manaya is giving a bath to one of her roommates' daughters because apparently in this shelter don't nobody take care of their, <laughs> nobody take care of their freaking kids so she's over here pretty much taking care of people kids. So her name is actually Raya. I changed it from Manaya. Her name is Raya. So Raya's over here giving a bath to freaking who is this? Let me turn on my yeah, freaking. I think this is Holly. Ah. <laughs> I don't think this is Harmony that she's giving a bath to. Huh. And she's just Raya's like what is going on Like I'm the one here that don't want my baby These people had their kids and everything And I'm over here taking care of other people's kids Where they do that at So we're gonna put Raya in her bed Um, We're gonna have Raya go to sleep Where's her bed room? Shout out to Barbie Sims on the build Um Shout out to Barbie Sims on the build. This is her build. Um, I'm trying to clean up because we were told that we have to keep the shelter clean. We have to get to cooking level three. And we have to um, get um, some stuff 
we gotta go to one of the meetings in order for us to move on to phase two in the shelter where we would get an uh, um an apartment complex or an apartment we have to apply for it through the shelter in order for them to like help us out so what we're gonna do is it's three o'clock in the morning we just received twenty dollars we have five thousand dollars in our account right now um we've been working part-time for a minute and our parents gave us 2500 when they kicked us out they was like look we know we telling you you gotta go but nevertheless like we don't want you out here like without nothing and so Rai is like, look, 2500 I could possibly buy me my own little shed. She said, I could buy me my own shed. She's like, the money I got right now, I can possibly, um, get me a little apartment somewhere in, like, a little neighborhood somewhere. But Rai is like, she wants to save up a little bit more. Her parents have instilled the, uh, the workaholic in her so she really just wants to like make more money so she can make sure that she's not gonna struggle and she doesn't want the pregnancy but at the same time she's like oh I don't want to get an abortion either God. like I can't do that to my unborn she's like I don't want you but I can't get an abortion either so she's actually going to try to go to some counseling sessions so try to make peace with this pregnancy um hopefully she can because baby this is one of our other sims this is luna luna is also a pregnant sim who is staying in the shelter um we're trying to clean up a little bit but it seems like nothing wants to get clean we got mail that we gotta get that we ain't never get we got like it's a lot i'm not gonna lie it has been a trial because nobody want to take care of their babies. First off, I had an infant and I had to age up the infant so fast because her mom was not paying any type of attention to her. So her mom was not paying any type of attention to her. So we had no choice but to, what you would call it, but to help her out. Like we had no choice whatsoever. So... We have homework to do. We over here taking care of other people's kids. We got to deal with our own stuff, with our own pregnancy. We got a part-time job that we had for a while now. Like, we need to we need to relax. Let's, we're very tense. Let's look at some TV. Let's, um, we gonna, we gonna, let me get a router in here. It's supposed to be free Wi-Fi. I didn't put it free Wi-Fi yet. But baby, they are stressing me out already. They are really stressing me out already. I cannot. <laughs> I cannot. No smoking inside. Um, it's also a... It's very homey. So, I'm gonna go over some of the rules that they have here. But um, pretty much, so to get to phase two where she can move into one of the homes that the shelter provides, there you go. So in order for her to move into one of the homes that the shelter provides, um, she has to do a few things. So the first thing she has to do is she has to reach cooking skill level three because in the new town home or apartment that the shelter provides, um, she'll have to cook her own food. Like, she already got to cook her own food, but she kind of has help here. But out there, it's going to be pretty much like she's living by herself. So, she has to get, um, she has to get her cooking skill up to level, um, three. She's currently at a level two, so we're doing good in that aspect. Um, the next thing she has to do is in order to even apply for her phase two, she has to make sure that she is a B average student. So she has to have at least a B average in school in order for her to even apply for it. 
and then the last thing she has to do is she has to attend three group meetings which are pretty much like each week so each week on Sunday they have a group meeting and she is to attend said group meetings now if she doesn't that's what she needs to do if she wants to opt into phase two however because this is a come as you are shelter or come and go as you please shelter she can also um she cannot she can completely phase out of the program early if she decides to get her own um apartment or house or land or something like that she can completely phase out of the program but yeah so ain't no telling what's gonna happen but yeah so that's pretty much the gist of it um they're responsible for their own food of course the people pay for it but they're responsible for their own food and their own well-being for the most part the well-being of their kids um the program director we may control her every now and again and like just try to help her out but for the most part it's all on her but she is in a good like she is in an okay mood but she wants some fried cabbage so i think she's going to make a serving of fried cabbage and then we'll try to see if we can get her to go to a counseling or something for the baby. She just wants to get on the computer. One thing I hate about these computers. But that's where people check in. So we may get some new uh, teen moms and or single moms or anything like that that just need some help. So we're going to help out where we can and do what we can. Now Desiree... She's gonna just talk to Desiree and she's going to. She's pretty much just gonna discuss entry. She goes to school with all the girls, but some of them she may not know. She just sees them in passing. So, pretty much, yeah. So she's gonna cook something to eat and talk to the girls. Miss Lamb is mad at the world. She is mad at the world right His now. His ways are and see. She's like, Kareel. I'm over this. That's Miss Desiree. Miss Desi is so pretty. So this is Desiree and her daughter is Desi. Um, I don't know where they are. I don't, I don't know where the kids are. Who is over here? This is Harmony. Harmony is over here asleep even though she got a bed. Oh, Lord. Where's Desi? At least she's sleeping. Where's Desi at? I don't I don't see Desi. I don't see Desiree's daughter. What's going on? Did Desiree's daughter come over here? Is she over here? Oh what what? No. Oh, there's Desi. Oh god. Desi of the ace. So Desiree's daughter is Desi. <laughs> She's a gassy little baby, but we've been just trying to help out where we can. Um, we're actually going to control Luna because since she's the other pregnant one, I know she's going to have um, and stuff that we're going to do with her, so we'll control her. So pretty much make sure that she's taking care of herself with her pregnancy. I don't want to control everybody. I hope that they just take care of the kids. But, you know, she has an unwanted child on the way. She has to pee. I'm hoping that they don't start a fire. Wait, is she flirting? Your daughter's crying. What are you, what are you just looking at her for? Oh, God, Desi. I gotta control you, too. Your child is crying. What are you doing? Your child is crying. Your child is crying. Your child needs you. What are you doing? Oh, God. This poor baby. I don't want her to lose it. I don't want none of them to lose their babies, but Jesus Christ, girl. Your baby is crying. Take care. Why are you just looking at her like you don't... What are you doing? You about to make me mad. What are you doing? Like, control her, please. 
Why can't I control her? Your child is crying. Desi. Zula. Oh my god. Huh? No, but. But no swoon. Uh huh. Wait, Bo. Why can't I control this child? Septa. Septa. I think she's broken. Not you about to go to sleep and your child is down here crying. What are you doing? Y'all are getting me mad. You're getting me upset. Let me add you to the family or something because you're making me upset. I don't understand. I just, I just, I don't understand. I don't get it. Desiree, what are you doing? What are you, what are you doing? Why can't I control you? This is not like you. Like, and the crazy part is before I put Raya into this, in here, they were taking care of their kids. So I was making them take care of the kids, but. Control her. Control her. Oh my God. Why can I not control this girl? Why can I not control you? Why can I not control you? Turn her into a household member. Thank you. Girl. Go clean your child. Before your child go to day scare. Go to day scare. What? Check your toddler. Check on your baby. Desi, you're not going to preschool today. It's raining. Like, well, yeah, you are because the mom's got to go to, um, what you call it? Give her a bath. Give her some love. Give her something. Can I have to fix our relationships? Like, let me check if I got to fix our relationship. No, that is your, that's your child. You know what? You just got me upset. Symphony and Harmony. Y'all, where you at? Because Harmony's down here asleep. So where is Symphony? Like, where? Symphony, where you at? I don't, I don't even understand where she is. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on. I don't like not knowing what's going on. I don't know what's going on. I gotta control you too, so you can take care of your child. Jesus Christ. Oh, Symphony went to work. Period, Symphony. She said she gonna do what she gotta do. Come on. I forgot Symphony got a job in the morning. So she be at work early, and then she go to school. So she took an early shift. But I'm trying to... Okay, Symphony has a field trip to go to. Desi, y'all all gonna have to go to school soon. Go take care. You putting, why are you putting her in your baby's bed? Okay, put her in the baby, put her in that bed. It don't, it don't, it don't even matter. Y'all fall asleep wherever y'all fall asleep. Go. Put her in the bed. And then come here, and then we gonna put Desi to bed. Desi to bed. Both of them just let them sleep. Desi is a gassy baby. I don't know why she always stinks, but she just always stinks. It's just nothing I can do about that. Send all students along. Them for you. Thank you, Desi. <laughs> I'm just gonna cheat your fun up. You go to school. Raya, you're hungry. You got a lot to do, girl. I should have you cut school today, actually. I should, I believe I should have you cut school today. Because I don't think Raya, I don't think Raya gonna be able to handle this. I don't think she's gonna be able to handle this. Look at her face. She's like, 
I'm so over this. I'm so mad at the world. She's like, I hate everybody. Everybody hates me. <laughs> She's like, I'm done. We're going to have to um, pregnancy a family. Go to counseling. Yes, right. You're going to skip school today. We need you to go to some type of counseling. Do you want to participate? Okay, sure. We'll participate. She's off to school. She is a C student. Desi, you're a C student as well. Luna, you're a C student. Oh. Riker, you got a new sentiment with Riker. You received 124 from royalties. Honestly, I don't think we're gonna stay in this. Um, I don't think we're gonna stay in the shelter for long. Um, I think we're gonna actually phase out early. Oh, Yume. Cabbage. I think we're gonna phase out early. I'm not a hundred percent sure, Maybe. but baby, she is tired. <laughs> like, I'm tired. Like nobody wants to take care of their kids, so I low key want to just move her into an apartment because we can yeah, do battle by ourselves. Eh? Like, We don't need to come to the shelter to have to take care of other people's kids when we're supposed to be here to try to figure out and fix everything with our own kid. Like, we can do that in the comfort of our own space. Mm. Mm. So yeah, I, think, I think she's going to weigh her options of phasing out. Hmm. She has three days until her second trimester. Nah, near May. No, she's not going to phase two in time of her second trimester because of school. But honestly, I feel like we're really going to, um. Phase out. I low-key don't want to do the shelter. Because it's just it's too much and it's not working. And I don't oh, like you Bara! So I think uh, we're gonna actually. Uh, we're gonna move. Wangle. Travel. Uh huh. We're going to remove all these people from my household and I think we're gonna just move into a little shack or something and try to make something happen because we can't do this shelter nonsense. Like, we can do that on ourselves. So we're gonna go look at some stuff and then we'll make our decision. So I'll be right back. Okay, you guys, I'm back. And it's our mother visiting the shelter for us. Like, are you trying to ask us to come back home, Ma? Like, our mom kicked us out along with our dad because they said they wasn't about to support us and the baby but now our mom is visiting us at the shelter i mean i know we told her that we was gonna be going to the shelter but i didn't expect mama to come so that's crazy but we do have to move sis out of the way so we're going to um eventually we're going to separate everybody in the household and we're moving her to a shack. Like, she's getting, she's going to go move to Santa Coya in a little house somewhere because she can't take this shelter. She's like, they're not setting a good example for me. Like, nobody's taking care of their kids. Like, I'm taking care of other people's kids. And I haven't even came to terms with the fact that I'm having my own kid. So, it's crazy to her that she's here. So she's like, you know what? I'm gonna run, like, I'm gonna leave the shelter. I'm gonna phase out early. And I'm just gonna. She's like, I'm a, I'm a phase out of the shelter. And she's like, I'll just come back for like group meetings and stuff. She's like, I'm gonna talk to 
Miss Joanna and see if she's okay with me coming back for like the group meeting so we can like talk about stuff and me coming to visit, you know. But for the most part, she's like, I can't stay here. She's like, I really can't stay here. Like, nobody's taking care of their kids. And, like, it's just not, it's not the best environment for me right now. So, Miss Mamtia is going to, well, Symphony, what are you doing, Symphony? Symphony is always on this computer. Like, sis, what are you doing? She's at daycare. She's at school. She's at school. She's at school. Turn it in. Okay, Desiree is doing her thing in school, though. I give her that. But let's speed them up coming back home because, yeah, we're leaving. We thought the shelter would help us out and would be a good place for us. However, we can do battle by ourselves. So we're going to go. And on her way home from school, she's seen this little shack house that didn't look like anybody live there so she's gonna come over here now she doesn't have a um she's gonna come here and eat uh luna you're gonna come eat she's like look i brought the cookbook i'm taking it with me <laughs> She's like, I'm taking it with me. She's like, look, if y'all ever need a place to, like, crash or chill, if I ever get the space, then I'll be able to help y'all out. She's like, but as of right now, she's like, I can't do it right now. Mm. She's like, I, I can't. And Miss Joanne is going to be like, well, look, take something with you so that way you can have something for the baby. I'm like, thank you, Miss Joanna. You're so nice. But we're just going to take... She's like, something for the baby. She's like, what can I take for the baby that's, like, not that bad? She's like, you know what? I'm going to take a pack and flush it. Rye is like, I'm going to take me a pack and play. So we're going to stop controlling all of these sims and we're going to move out. So we're going to stop controlling her. Um, I'm sorry, loves. I know. I know. We didn't want to, but we just got to, we got to stop controlling y'all. We got to, yeah, we got to turn to household NPC. We got to stop controlling y'all because we can't. Like, we got to go. We're going to add her to the roommates. And then we're going to stop controlling Desi. And then Desiree, look, we love you, girl, but we can't do this. If y'all want to get y'all kids taken away, like, y'all do that on your own accord. She's like, I know I'm not too keen on kids, but she's like, at least if I mess up, I mess up on my own accord, like out there on my own, doing my own thing, not in a shelter that's supposed to be helping me and I'm still messing up. She's like, I'm not doing it. And some of y'all may say I rush her to get out the shelter, but look, I can't, okay, I can't. We will rag to riches this bad boy and call it a day. Sure, right. Sure, Desi. We can be best friends. But let's... We gotta get you out the family. 
Because you didn't go to school today either. You were asleep all day. So we're gonna don't control you. Um. Now the money that she does have, she has five thousand dollars. Let me see. She has five thousand six hundred and seventy-four dollars. So what we're gonna uh -huh. do is we're gonna change her money. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna money zero. Take all her money away. And then we're going to transfer her money out of the bank into her household inventory. That way she's able to go buy this place that she's seen on her way home from work. Delish. Whatever she could do with that is what she could do with that. So she's like, um, okay, let me take Simona this money out. Simona Sarah, have a win. Let's manage the account. Yeah, but same. Before somebody trying to use our money, the and then we're going to be mad. Transfer from you to household funds. And then we're going to transfer 5674 Maybe she'll go to her mom's house and like visit while they're at work or something to get her her furniture from home. No. First things first is she. She wants to see if she can get one of the apartments in San Mai. Should know first. Because she owns this now, she's um Ooh, she got to take the furniture. Okay, we're gonna move her a different way. Cause I don't want her to take the furniture out of the shelter. I just wanna have to take what's in her inventory. Here, but I haven't seen them. 
Alright, Miss Joanna gave us the okay to take some stuff, but we're gonna focus the camera on Miss Joanna. Pause. Alright, so we're going to remove her from the roommate and we're going to add her to the family. So we're going to add them to the family. And then after we add them to the family, we'll, um, all right, cool. So now we could split her from the household. split her from the household which is what we intended to do anyway so let's edit transfer sales between households now all that money is hers so she's taking all of it area because my split from household is not working so we're gonna move her in and this is where she's moving into so now she brought this little shack that she's seen on the corner and um We're gonna say her rent is about, we're gonna say her rent is like 900 a week. So we're gonna take $900 out of her check every Sunday. So first things first is we're gonna come in here. $869, which means we need a kitchen. So I'm not going to do a great big old kitchen in here right now. We just need something for her to make some food. So where is my... Where is my other kitchen stuff? have to go die for some thrills because baby we are both broke now. to cook a lot of stuff. So we got this. So, I 
haven't done a racks to riches for so long, so I think it's crazy. But we have to get her in. She gotta have a bed that's on the floor, she gotta have a bed that's on the floor. She's once again like, look, she's like, I know it's not much, but I can really do battle by myself. And actually, we have more money than this. I just have to transfer it out. So we're going to manage the accounts. We're going to transfer from there to her household funds. We're going to transfer that $1,000 that she had in her savings account. We transfer it now. Then we're also going to transfer... $451 that we got to our household account. This way we can at least attempt to build a bathroom. So let's see if we can get a little bathroom together. What we got? We got $1,477. So we should be able to get a bathroom up in here.
the cabinet in her um she had a medicine cabinet but there's no way to found it okay, once we get some more money we'll um expand and make sure we got everything that we need to be able to take care of our little baby. Now, Sis also does stream, so eventually we're going to hopefully find her a computer. And then, let's see if we can find a cheap, cheap, keyword cheap. can find cheap computers, period. Come through cheap. We can probably we can get her a bigger bed. Look at us. That thousand dollars came in clutch. Yes, I'm using CC, but still. somebody else's kids because they're not doing what they're supposed to be doing. She's like, I'm going to be okay. I'm going to make it. And hopefully after a while, when my mother realizes I'm gone, she might be coming. Hopefully your mom invites you to come back home. Cause baby, your mama is mad at you.
we can afford one curtain. So nobody see us when we sleeping. that Miss Joanna gave her from the Desiree wants to go to prom with me Desiree what are you doing <laughs> in my house though that's what I want to know <laughs> what like, how do you just pop up in my house when I'm sleeping like, that ain't cool <laughs> She's like, that is not cool. What are you doing here? Desiree, not, they got a high romance level. Wait, wait. Desiree, <laughs> what is this? Go, go home. Why are you in my house? Yeah, but Get hey, out of here. Sober baby, uh, spout. We we can we need to we need to lift this in the bud right now. Hold on, we need to we need to lift this in the bud real fast. Look, Desiree, we are friends. Yes, like, Alyssa Rack, Fanes. We just gonna we gonna be friends, okay? All right, bye. Oh no. Try to lock my door for everyone. But y'all, we got a little house, y'all. It's lit. We got our own little spot, our own little space, our own little everything. Like we lit right now. But I've started to lose control. Alright. Now, we will see y'all when she gets back from work. We're going to have her work hard. And I'll see you guys when we get back from work. Matter of fact, I'm probably going to play her off camera for a little bit. But, um... Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that alert bell this way you never ever never ever miss a video i guess because we're not in we're not in the shelter anymore so we can manage our accounts so our money can go into our household inventory as well as our um um our deposit Set all to 50. All right, so we want to make sure we get in everything together. But yes, you guys, I'm going to end the episode here. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that alert bell. This way you never, ever, never, ever miss a video. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye, guys.